Today I'm gonna to show you how to quickly add a smart light or a smart plug to your Google Home if you've already linked a specific partner account. Let's get started. Hey everybody, welcome to Tech with Brett, where I help tech work for you. Now in previous videos, I've already shown you how to set up smart lights and then add those lights to your Google Home through the Google Home app under the home control settings. Now in this video, I'm just gonna show you how you can add a new light or a smart plug very easily through the Google Home. So the first step is you need to go to the partner application and set up that light or smart switch first. So today we're using a new Sangled smart colored light. So I've gone into the Sangled application and gone through the process to set that up. And so now I can easily turn on and off the light from the application. So now I wanna be able to control it with the Google Home and I've named this the new color light for this video. So if I ask the Google Home right now, hey Google, turn off new colored, Sorry, I don't understand. Doesn't know what I'm talking about. But now there are two commands you can use to easily sync your devices and refresh what is linked to the home control settings. So one is called sync my lights and the other one is sync my devices. So let's try it out. Hey Google, sync my lights. Okay, syncing devices for six providers. Okay, so it's gone through and reactivated all the lights that are on those accounts. So now if I say, hey, Turn off new colored. Sure, turning off the new colored. Just like that, super easy. Hey Google. Turn on new colored and turn new colored blue. You got it, turning the new colored on. And okay, changing the new color to it blue. It turned it blue, pretty awesome. So another cool thing that you can do with this is if you go into the Google Home app and you add maybe different nicknames or you change the names of the lights in the partner app. So I went through and if I change this and I ask the Google Home to sync my devices, it would resync all of those. So if you're having issues with it knowing what light you're talking about, that is something you can quickly do to reset everything. Now another cool tip is if you're having problems with your Google Home and the smart lights, you may wanna change the names of them. So try and stay away from any numbers, try and stay away from special characters in the name, and then don't name them the same thing as a room. So if here I have the office and I name it Office Light One, that would not be a good name because I'm using office and I'm using light one. Another thing you shouldn't do is here I have like a light on the left and a light on the right. Try not to name it light left, light right. It gets a little confused, but have specific names for those lights and that will help all of your home control settings. And depending on the light that you have, you will be able to change the color and you can also change the brightness like this. Hey Google. Set the brightness on new colored to 5%. You got it, setting the new colored brightness to 5%. Set the new colored light to 100%. You got it, setting the new colored brightness to 100%. Pretty easy. So if you guys have any further questions about syncing your lights to your Google Home, let me know in the comments below. And if you'd like to see more things that you can do with smart home lighting, please check out my playlist over here on the side. If this is your first time here, I would love to have you subscribe and select that bell icon so that you can be notified of all my new and upcoming videos. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one.